start the field when I have so many. Okay, we're gonna... Hmm. Hey guys, it's Jay, and today I am here with my May favorites for 2017. I don't have that many, I think, but this is what I say before every video, and then I just ramble, and the video ends up being like 16 minutes long. So without further ado, let us get started. So my first favorite is my hair. I think I have an obsession now with dyeing my hair really random colors. I just think that it's so much fun. The one that I use usually is the Laurier Colorista hair dye. So it looks like this in the box. I've done purple and I've done indigo. This one is the teal. It looks like this and it's super easy. It's semi-permanent so when you shower it comes out. So I like it because if I end up hating it I just like shower. And then it's fine. I haven't hated any of them yet so that's a good sign. It comes in a wide variety of colors like there's pink purples, blues, and like reds. I always go for the like purple or blues because those are around my favorite colors and also the pink won't show up in my hair. And I also have to think about what it's gonna look like when it washes out because the indigo one turned this weird like greenish color which is weird because indigo is like blue and purple so yeah I consider that too when you're going into it. But yeah I love dyeing my hair. It's my new obsession. The only bad thing I would say about dyeing your hair crazy colors is that you can only wear like white, black, and gray or it clashes with things. So you're very limited in the wardrobe you can wear now, which sucks because, I mean, mostly I wear white and black and gray, so it's not that big of a deal, but sometimes when you wanna wear colors, like in the summertime, I wear like really bright colors, but now I can't because hair. My next favorite is Harry Potter. As you guys know, I haven't ever read Harry Potter in my life, so I am now reading all the books. I'm on the third one now. I'm obsessed with Harry Potter, I'm jumping on the bandwagon, I waited way too long to read the books, I'm 21 and this is my first time reading them, but I have reactions for the first two books in the series, so I'm going to do my third, fourth, fifth, sixth, and seventh when I get to them, but if you want to check those out, you should, because Harry Potter's great. My next favorite is actually the lipstick that I'm wearing, it is the NYX Liquid Suede Cream Lipstick, and it's in Soft Spoken. I'm obsessed with this. I have this one lipstick that I wear every single day, and I love it so much. So I was like, I don't really want to try a new one, but this, this is my life right now. And it doesn't clash with the hair, so, so great. But it goes on really well. It stays on all day. So, love it. It's great. My next favorite this month is actually the necklace that I'm wearing. It came from a Charmed Aroma candle, which I've talked about before. Charmed Aroma is like a candle service that you get, and it comes either with a ring, a necklace or a bracelet. I always usually go for the rings, but my mom and I decided we were going to try the necklace this time. I love it so much. It's three circles with three diamonds down the middle. You can't really see it. I can't do the zoomy zoomy because I'm not camera technologically smart. So just, just look at it here. Beautiful, beautiful. But I love it. My next favorite is the Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2 movie. Oh my god, I watched it and it is so good. Little Baby Groot is the cutest thing in the entire world and Drax is hilarious. They're my two favorite characters by far. They're so cute and I love them so much. I don't usually like superhero movies, but Guardians of the Galaxy is like my one exception that I actually love those movies. My next favorite is a TV show and it is the Little Big Shots TV show with Steve Harvey. I just discovered it this month and it is the funniest thing in the entire world. The kids on it are hilarious. It's basically like kind of like a talent show-ish. It's like showing kids talents and what they're good at. But it is so funny the way that these kids interact with Steve Harvey and Steve Harvey just sits there and laughs at them basically but it is so funny and some of the kids are so sassy and I love it so much. If you haven't watched it, seriously watch it. And like some of the talents that these kids have are actually like crazy. And now my favorite part of the videos because it means I get to lip sync badly and dance. And they are my favorite music for this month. So I have a total of five songs that I'm going to show you guys. Um, some of them are a little bit inappropriate but um, that's okay. The first song that I am loving this month is <laughs> Drop That Kitty by Ty Dolla Sign, Feet, Charlie XCX, and Tanashi. I love it so much. It is such a banger and I play it in the car all the time. <laughs> So as I said, not very appropriate, but 
such a banger. Next one is Say Nada by Shaka Feet JME. I love this song too. Such a banger. It just makes me want to dance so much. <laughs> It just makes me want to dance every time I hear it. I love that song. The next song is also a song that just makes me want to dance every time I hear it. It's more popular than the rest of my songs. So it is That's What I Like by Bruno Mars. Banger. Oh my god, I love that song. I hated it at the beginning because it was so overplayed, but now it's my jam. Next two songs are kind of on the less popular side. I don't think a lot of people have heard of them. One of them you probably have started hearing on the radio because it's getting more popular. It is Issues by Julia Michaels. Something about her voice just, ugh, I love it so much. I think it's so pretty. Something about her voice makes my little heart swoon. The next song is called Pretty Girls by Maggie Lindman. I found this song by accident, but I love it so much. I love it so much. I just, it's my anthem, guys. It's my anthem for the month. All right, guys, so those were all my favorites for the month of May. Also, another favorite, my mother. Hey, mom, I love you. You're always my favorite. Let me know down below some of your favorites for this month, and I'll see you all in my next video. Goodbye.